what is going on everybody are you here back on the video here today we're gonna to be watching angel season one episode 17 last episode they saved angel from the ring and they got the those two dudes that kidnapped him and locked him in the cage they killed them they got they let everybody go free even the bad vampires all that stuff the monsters they let them all go and uh, there was no kate in that episode so that was kind of sad um but you know i want to see more kate Angel and Kate, like, you know, that's the ship right there. Hopefully, we see them. Hopefully, we see her come back because she hasn't been in an episode since her dad died, but that was like only like an episode ago. So, hopefully, maybe this episode she'll be back. Who knows? But, um, yeah, there's not really much to touch on, but let's dive right into this episode. And, uh, here we go. If you enjoyed the video, please give a like, comment, subscribe. We just hit 150 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. Let's hit 200. Here we go. Let's get it. Maybe we can make a break for it. Impossible. Uh, well, for an exit. What's going on? What's going on? We might try shooting fire. Oh, bro, they're watching a movie. Or oh, yeah. they're watching a play. Oh. Yes. A play. Oh, Cordelia's play. <laughs> so, what did you guys think? <laughs> Well, your projection was excellent. Yeah, I could hear every word, and we were waiting. Bro. Okay, so I was loud, but was I any good? <laughs> oh my you, gosh. You, you took the role and made it your own. Really, Ed? I, mean, I wouldn't say it if I didn't think so. Thanks. He didn't say it though. You didn't say <laughs> it. I don't believe it. Okay, well, you know, Bro. it was a night in the theater I'll never forget. He gave me his card. What? I was working him all night, and he gave you his card. <laughs> I thought I had a quality. Wow. Oh, snap. It's a drive-by. It's a drive-by. Dang. Dang, bro. He really saved her. Oh, my God. Rebecca. Excuse me. Are you all right? Oh, he's fine. It was such an honor to save your life, Miss Lowell. Bro. Thank you. I'm sorry I didn't get your name. Cordelia Chase. I'm so <laughs> Cordelia, glad you oh my god. Oh, he doesn't even know who you are. <laughs> you don't know me. Sure he doesn't. I'm sure he'll accept a small reward anyway. No thanks. Look, I'd like to apologize. Oh, oh. He does that. Here's our card. If you ever need rescuing or just want to pal around or something, call us. Let go. Your protector to the stars. They're gonna be lining up at the door. Glad I beat the crowd then. Oh, snap. Oh my god. <laughs> no. I didn't mean them. Um, coffee? Tea? We don't have anything good here. Uh, but our intern would be happy. Intern. <laughs> Dang, she gotta do my boy Wesley like that. Can we talk? Sure. Right in here. So, how can I help you? I have a stack of these at home All the same, written in blood He also has my personal telephone number Scary calls in the middle of the night Please It's not blood Are you sure? Try the police Oliver's been after me too, but Then I'd just be hand-feeding the story to the Inquirer No thanks How do you know I won't do the same? I don't. But I do know that you came out of nowhere and saved my life last night. I know you didn't ask for anything in return. And I know I feel safer in this office than I do in my own home. Wow, that's kind of crazy. I can't take your case. You bro, ready? take her case? What the heck? The Cordelia is so funny, bro. I don't <laughs> understand. Give that information to me. She you. gotta relax. Still find the guy. You don't need me. She does need you. That's why she came, though. My first big connection in Hollywood, and you practically throw her out of the office. <laughs> Haven't you ever heard of networking? Cordelia. No. What is your thing? He likes her. Oh, whoa. He's afraid of getting close. Oh, no. He's supposed to only like Kate. Because of his curse? Kate. That's it. You'd have to get awfully close to her for that. Where is Kate? And in the meantime, you could be helping me. The person who needs help here is Miss Lowell. Right. 
What's the sex thing in my vision? Bro, no. she, wait, she hasn't, hasn't had a vision oh, in forever. It's Rebecca. There's She's no way. Danger. <laughs> Terrible danger. <laughs> oh, no. Who is that? Oh, snub. Angel, bro, it's time to go. Come on. What did I just say, Angel? Yo, I didn't think he was gonna show up. And he did. Oh! Oh, she. she uh oh. She knows something. I know you're still here. Dang, how did she know he was still there? What the heck? I'm not what you think. You're not? Because no reflection, dark, private office, instantly knowing those letters weren't written in blood. I guess what I would think is vampire. Oh, look at that. Again. Which is impossible. Bella Lugosi, Gary Oldman, they're vampires. Frank Langella was the only performance I believed, but... This is real. You're real. You're really not afraid. Most people who saw what you saw. I'm not most people. There's something up with her. She's definitely hiding something. I lied to Oliver. I don't really want to be alone tonight. Happiness? And what are the odds he'd find it with an actress? What's that supposed to mean? Yeah. <laughs> You're what, a uh, 44 long? Why? Oh, gosh. <laughs> Can't go without my bodyguard. Man, this is going to be bad. He's going everywhere with her and watching her. Oh, he's actually in his bag a little bit. Oh, snap, bro. God, if I had to sit through every one of these, I'm sure Gordon would kill me. Bro. Back up. Let's go. Yo, watch this dude be at fault. Like, probably, he's probably the one setting up all this stuff. I know the stalker. I've seen him. At your house. He's a stuntman. You used to represent him. Oh. Oh, I, I didn't get a good look. Oh, come on, Oliver. My private phone number, how to get into my house, that I skipped the movie at a premiere. Only you know all that. Dang. Look at I that. I would have let you get hurt. I knew it. I knew he was the one. I thought the publicity might help you get the series. I did it out of love. I don't pay you to love me. No. That you get for free. Hmm. Oh, she better not even ask him to, to turn her. That'd be kind of crazy. Thanks for coming. Sure oh wow, they're actually she's actually out with Cordelia right now. Oh. You can I mean you do I can drink other liquids. Yeah. Good. Your stalker, he's not really Oh, that. I already know. You do? It turns out we share representation. Oliver. Set the whole thing up to revive my flagging career. I feel like this time she's actually going to get kidnapped and it's not going to be good. Yeah, I'm not feeling it. Uh, I ain't feeling it. <laughs> oh, bro. Oh. <laughs> what is she up to? Bro, what the heck? I promise not to ruin your wardrobe in the process. Yeah, get her out of here. Yeah, nah. Trash. No. Don't drink it. Don't drink it. Don't drink it. Don't drink it. Oh, no. The whole time Rebecca's real Gabby asking questions about Angel... Well, what sorts of questions? Oh, you know, where does Angel hail from? What's his favorite color? What kind of aftershave he wears? The exact specific details on how someone could make themselves into a vampire? Surely you don't think. <sighs> what? That she'd try to maneuver Angel into an exchange of bodily fluids in order to make herself eternally young and beautiful, thus saving her failing career? Gee, now that you mention it. Yep. No, no. Oh, 
I actually liked her too. I thought she was gonna be good. Yeah, she's not good. Nah, we gotta get her out of here. That's why Kate is number one. Oh my god, I knew it. See, she just wants to be turned. No. We won't have to be lonely, either one of us, ever again. You're wrong. You don't know what it is you're asking me to do. I wasn't afraid, was I? When I looked into the mirror and you weren't there, I didn't scream. I didn't run. I understood. No, you weren't afraid. You looked into that mirror and all you saw was yourself. But that's all you ever see, Rebecca, and that's what only really frightens you. Oh. This isn't about the way the studio or the network or your fans see you. It's about how you see yourself. Your own reflection has been corrupted into something unrecognizable. You think you want it to stay the same? What you really want is to make it disappear. You're supposed to help people. Help me. You want me to help you? Fine. Oh. What are you doing? Big decision, Rebecca. Eternity. <laughs> Dang, bro. What the heck? Ain't you? Dang. What is that stuff that she gave him? What did that do? This is so bad. You put something in my drink. I just wanted you to relax a little, Angel. Lower the defenses a little. What was it? Just a little. Happy thing. I'm so sorry. Everybody's so sorry. <laughs> oh. Oh. Perfectly happy. Oh, gosh, man. This ain't good. In my years, I never killed a famous person before. But with no witnesses, hey, who was going to believe me? I'm... I just wanted to... Be like me? Hey, can't say I blame you. I'm one happy fella. Bro. <laughs> oh. Now that I respect. <laughs> Dang, how did Wesley and them get there? Oh, but then it's connected. I don't know why I thought it was somewhere else. <laughs> you did it with them, didn't you? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. What you did to him. I didn't do anything. With respect, Miss Lowell, you must have done something. Yep, she did. Well, I may have given him something to help loosen him up, and now he's loose? Yeah. What did you give him? Does it matter? Well, if he's all homicidal, I'm thinking, yeah! Doximal. <laughs> Doximal? Doxy what? Powerful tranquilizer. It induces bliss. Bliss? As in bliss? Sheer contentment? Perfect happiness? It's synthetic, not true happiness. This is really good stuff. He hasn't really turned. It's an illusion, not real. He bit me. Yeah. Still, we might want to leave the premises for a while, just until the effects wear off. Well, are you sure they will wear off? Reasonably sure. Oh, oh snap. Angel. I want you to listen to me. What you're experiencing is not genuine. You've been fed a drug. It's simulating bliss. All that you're feeling is just chemical suggestion. Oh, man. Look at it, bro. Whoa, he looks actually evil. Name's Angelus. Oh, snap. Wesley, no! Back off. <laughs> what are you going to do? Met me. One more step and you'll find out. You think this is just water? You're bluffing. Am I? You don't think I wasn't ready for this, do you? That I hadn't prepared for it? Why do you think I have a stake stashed in my desk, a Ooh. cross in my back? I think about this happening every single day. That's just drinking water. Fresh from a mountain spring delivered right to our door, then blessed every second Tuesday by Father Mackey, the local parish priest, while you're down in the bat cave, sleeping through the better part of the day. Oh. And the Oscar goes to. Yeah. Yo, it's that easy just to stop Angel? <laughs> Are you still evil? <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry. Can I get another reading on that line, please? Rebecca, is she? Gone. Oh, and no. She won't be keeping you on retainer as her bodyguard. I think it was the trying to murder her that lost you the gig. I need to apologize to both of you. There's really no need. Uh, hello? <laughs> the drugs couldn't be helped. 
You walk a fine line, Angel. I don't envy you. Wesley. Nice moves up there. Dang. Cordelia. Okay. Here's something I never thought I would say to you. Oh. Wesley's right. Forget about it. But I really didn't mean mm, it. Yes, right. you did. And I'd appreciate it if you didn't try to weasel out of it. <laughs> Dang. And Jealous may not be the most relaxing company, but at least he's honest. Shouldn't I expect the same from the not evil version of my friends? Oh, she's right, she right. So we're okay then. I'm too big of a person to let something so petty get in the way of our friendship. I appreciate that. You're not gonna untie me, are you? <laughs> Damn, they were not gonna untie him. <laughs> Wesley? Cordelia? Alright, that was episode... 117 pretty good it wasn't amazing um yo there was no kate in this episode so this episode automatically loses a little bit off of it no kate um rebecca was pretty cool but then she was not so cool um drugging angel yeah, that was really just out of pocket out of line um it was really cool seeing Angel be like evil though. We should do like a few episodes. Like a, I wonder if they have a story arc where he's just evil on accident. Like somebody just makes him turns him evil or something like that. That was pretty interesting to see how he was when he was like that. Um, I like Cordelia calling him out at the end about her performance. Him actually telling her the truth about her performance. Wesley too. Yeah, Wesley's becoming really good. Like really, really good. A really good character. Um... And that was about it. I don't really think there's not really much because this episode was just like another standalone. It's not um, really didn't feel like it was too important to the whole story besides him turning evil and them like trying to understand how to take him down, which was pretty easy to take him down. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. But I don't know. It was pretty cool seeing him be evil for a little bit. But, yeah. I'm just mad there was no Kate in this episode. Like, yo, I need Angel and Kate to be together. And, um, yeah, but I don't know. It's, um, I do like Cordelia, though. Yo, Cordelia is so good. She's a good character. Um, and, yeah, I mean, that was pretty much it. I'm excited to see where it's going. I'm almost done with season one. Almost done. I got, like, five episodes left. So, I should finish this season rather quickly. Um, but that's wrap up the video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. Comment, subscribe. It's been Brother Z, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.